Happening today, new details are expected after a crash in Greenville County that left two people dead, including a seven year old girl. Seven News' Henry Coburn is joining us now with more on this. Good morning, Henry. Good morning, Sabila. This morning, the Greenville County Sheriff's Office will bring us more information on that deadly crash at a press conference. Now, we've brought you continued coverage on the wreck, which happened at the intersection of Whitehorse Road and Claxton Drive Monday night. Now, the Greenville County Sheriff's Office says a deputy was about to pull over a suspected DUI driver when the driver crossed the center line and hit an SUV head on. That crash killed the suspect driver, who the coroner identified as 35 year old Aiden Mamadoff. Now, deputies say all three people in the SUV, including a five year old and a seven year old were taken to the hospital. The coroner says seven year old Aliyah King, a second grader at Grove Elementary School, died from her injuries. Aliyah's family released a statement on Tuesday saying in part that she was quote loved by everyone that knew her and was so full of life and love. Now we're expecting updates from the sheriff's office at 10 this morning. We'll bring you all that new information on air and online. Fred.